starlight, star bright, the first star I see tonight. I wish I may, I wish I might. So good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, wherever you are in the world. Yes, it's me, April Love, here in Boston, wishing you a blessed time. I truly hope you're finding reasons to smile, to laugh, to enjoy life, to appreciate everything and everyone around you. And one thing I appreciate more than anything else is a clear sky where I can see the moon, the stars, like the camera I have, even the Canon, Canon camera that I have doesn't do the sky justice. But every time I see a clear night and the moon is shining big and the stars are out, all I can say is Alhamdulillah, which means um, which means praise to God, you know. And for me, that's a um, it's just a I don't know. I just feel a connection with the night sky. I I love it. I appreciate it. Um, I'm trying to stop my watch because I forgot to. I tracked my walking in the building on my building control. But whenever I see it, I take a deep breath and I just enjoy it. Anyway, I'm obviously at work. I think I already said that. Um, and I'm obviously in the vehicle at the moment. Because not only do I have to do a tour inside the building, I have to tour outside the building. So, um, and it's no fun doing it in the frigid cold. Last night it was so cold that I have gloves. You see them. Um, but even with the gloves on, within a few minutes, my... Uh, sorry, I flipped you. I don't know if this is going to be upside down now, but if it is, I hope it's more entertaining. <laughs> um, my fingers were so cold and I didn't even get really get out of the car. My fingers were so... Uh, I don't know if I'm just getting bad circulation if it was really the, the cold because my finger, I've never had my hands feel that painfully cold ever you know so um but overall i actually don't mind the snow i don't like working in it i don't like driving in it but you know i love looking at it that's another thing that just to look at it you know i can appreciate the beauty and the peacefulness that snow that snow brings with it and I'm a big kid at heart, and if I had more people to play with, <laughs> um, I'd be playing in the snow every time it snowed, you know. But I don't have enough kids around me. I don't have, an, don't really have any friends that I hang out with that I can, like, let's go sledding. Let's go have some fun, you know. Anyway, um, I'm going to continue to drive around, and uh, I'll talk to you in a bit movie of the day kale spinach pineapple cucumber um, a little bit of protein powder um, celery and uh, grapes it does taste decent and this one's for my mommy let's see how she likes it Fill to the top, so be careful. What's in it? Kale, spinach, celery, cucumber, uh, pineapple, and grapes, and a little bit of protein. Got her approval. <laughs> and now, I will drink. I think I'll drink mine and I gotta run and do my radio show. So have a sip and I'll see you in a bit. All right, so it's that kind of day. 
<laughs> and I'm off to the radio. Um, gotta come up with a poem, didn't write it yet. But today is Kenny Loggins Day because Kenny Loggins' birthday was January 7th. Happy birthday, Papa Loggins. If you know why I call him that, put a comment down below, a thumbs up, and let me know. And yeah, so off to the radio I go. I never left. <laughs> uh, I did go to the radio show. There's technical difficulties, so there was no show. Um, they're still working on the technical issues, so I am home, and I'm exhausted, and my mommy wants to go to the gym, and honestly, I do want to go to the gym too, but I've gotten three hours, of, less than three hours of sleep today, so we'll see how she's feeling, and see what we do. Back in the house we go. Lunch time. <laughs> so I didn't have my eggs this morning. I just had a bowl of cereal. So I'm having egg salad with green fries. I mean, celery, ketchup, I mean, hummus, and a cup of water. Then go to the gym. Um, yeah, so that's what's happening. So I'm going to eat this and I'm actually going to go lie down. Um, in the meantime, have a bite. Yeah, have a bite, and I'll talk to you in a bit. Currently Wednesday morning, just home from work. About to eat this lovely spinach feta egg sandwich with my ginger infused orange juice. And let's see if I can make it to the gym, or at least get, make an attempt at a workout today. So, it is, uh, 5.24, I didn't get up until about 4 o'clock, I'm still fairly tired because I couldn't sleep today. I spent most of the morning after the eggs in my room, lying down, got stuck, I got distracted with YouTube, was watching these people as I'm watching them again, <laughs> um, watching Roman again, um, I don't know, I've just been, my energy level again the last day or two has been blah. Um, even at work last night, I couldn't, like, I was struggling with energy even at work, um, and I hate it because, you know, there's so much I want to be doing and my energy levels is keeping me from doing it and I know it sounds like an excuse. Believe me, I try to push myself at least like with the t-shirt thing or even trying to get a video out and I feel like crap that I haven't been able to get good videos out. I haven't done a poetry video. I want to do a poetry video. Um, I have ideas for videos that I just haven't gotten around to executing. Even cooking, I want to cook, it, but it, during the time that I'm, I should be cooking, I'm sleeping. Like, probably in the next half hour, I'm going back to bed because I only slept, a, I'm lucky if I slept about three or four hours so far, and I got to work tonight. So, um, I don't know, this is just part of my daily frustrations and the, um, the not so productive or motivating part of my day but I figure I share it because I don't want to seem like everything is always positive because it's not always positive you know what I'm saying we have our down days we have our down moments and I could be working out right now but I keep going back you know I in in that sense I'm kind of using the excuse that I'm too tired 
I mean, I, can, I got weights over on the side. I could do that. I could be doing something. And maybe I will. I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to end this because it's already like 10 minutes long. Uh, and I'm just babbling. Anyway, I'm going to continue to try to record, uh, make videos and try to be more motivating. Not just for you, but for myself. Because I want this year to be the best year ever. I want to go to Morocco. I want to get my Jeep. I want so many wonderful things to happen. Not just for me, but for you. And like I said, I want to spread love and positivity. So I don't want to stay in this lazy negative mindset i still have the positive side going too it's just right now the not so positive side is kind of dominant but that too shall pass anyway till next time thank you for watching i appreciate you i appreciate you stopping by and watching the video if you like the video at all give it a thumbs up uh, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already i've gotten a couple more subscribers so i'm inching my way to that hundred mark and i thank you for those that are showing interest uh until the next video like love share and inspire much love peace